Okay, it says I'm live, so I should be live. Yes, okay. So what's going on, everybody? It's the Cage and Catcher here once again. And today we're doing something kind of unusual. We're doing another little live stream. Uh, but today we're doing a live stream of the uh, ETB box opening of the Ultra Prism. So let me just give you a look-see here. Oh, that pretty box. That pretty, pretty box. I love, love the look of this box. It is gorgeous. And we got all the stuff that it comes with in the back right there. So, of course, you get your collector box. You get your energy cards. I'm dropping my camera. Uh, the thing I used to steady my camera, that is. You get your deck dividers. You get your sleeves. Your de burn and poison GX coins. And then your damage counters. All in one beautiful little package. So gorgeous. So gorgeous. And then, of course, we get all these beautiful cards. There's a chance for a gold Lunala or Sagalio in this box. Plus, all the brand new Prism cards that I believe they're bringing back from the black and white days. So, let's go ahead and crack this open. And I decided to do this lifestyle, guys, because... Uh, I'm running a little on storage on my phone, <laughs> and I've been having computer problems here lately, and I have, uh, I've got the computer itself fixed, but I have not yet gotten all my programs redownloaded, so let's get some of this stuff out of the way. Alright, so we've got the player's guide here, and then, why not, let's just take a look and see what all, some of the stuff we can get. Oh, hello little brochure. Uh, let's see. What cards are we looking for? So, we're really wanting anything with a gold border here. Which is, we've got Crushing Hammer, an Escape Board, a Missing Clover, Peaking Red Card, a Unit Energy for Water, Leaf, and Fire type, and then a Unit Energy for Steel, Electric, and Psychic type. And then the Ultra Secret Rares. The ones we're really wanting is that Lunala Gold GX and the Segalio Gold GX. But don't forget, we've got the rainbows that are also always good. Uh, looks like we've only got one rainbow. Oh, wait, no, I screwed the page up. Okay, so we've got the full arts, which is Leafeon, Formosa, Glaceon, uh, Zooktree, I think that's what it is. Necrozma, Celesteel, and the, uh, let's see, Galgia, Palkia, we got trainers. Good, actually, amount of rainbow rares that we can get. So nice, but yeah. All right, let's move on with this unboxing here, and let's open it up. Oops, and not drop and destroy my set. So of course we get the eight, no, yeah, seven packs of Ultra Prism there. All the goodies inside. And let's see, I'm going to keep the sleeves out because we'll need that. Oh, no, we do get eight. There we go. All right. And then we dice and damage counter energy. Yeah, you can see all that, right? All right. We're not worried about that, right? That's not the meat and potatoes of this opening. We're worried about the cards. So let's get to the cards, baby. All right. Four of you are watching. Thank you very much for doing so. All right. Let me try and just kind of... Get these all looking nice and straight and in order here and recenter my camera a little bit. All right. So we've got eight beautiful packs of Ultra Prism to start off with today. And let's get going with the first pack. All right. Yubi Tubical, what's going on? Shark Stains. Sorry, guys, I can't really see the uh, chat too much because I've got the thing I'm using to prop the camera up blocking that. All right. All right. And as always, with Sun and Moon, the trick is four cards and then two, and then you put those four under the two. All right. And, oh, look at here. Just got released Gen 3 in Pokemon Go. We got Rosalia, Turtwig, Krogunk, Gibble. Rilu, Rilu, Fighting Energy, Gabite, Pokemon Fan Club, Cosmoem. That looks like the same Cosmoem from uh, Sun and Moon Base. 
Ooh, reverse hollow is an Eevee. Pretty Eevee. Oh, focus camera. And the rare is an Alolan Slash. Dude, that Alolan Slash. Sand Slash, if I can talk. Looks badass. I love that. So nice, nice, nice. All right, let me move my bulk out the way. Let's get on. So, Galio, what you gonna bring for us, buddy? All right. And let's see. Move that to the side. Try not to spoil anything for myself or for y'all. And yeah, guys, sorry if my voice is kind of cracky. I'm getting over a sinus cold. And, uh... <clears throat> It just sounds really gravelly to me. But, uh, all right. Come on, focus. All right, Truby. Magnemite. Sneasel. Alolan Diglett. Magmar. Water Energy. Volkner. Bronzong. Dotonator. The reverse is a Turtwig, and the rare is... Ooh! A Glaceon GX! Very nice. Very, very nice. Let me get the sleeves for that. Ooh. Yeah, I said that, and my wife was like, what? <laughs> what? You got what? A Glaceon. <laughs> so let me get the sleeves. And you know what? I see you guys are chatting. Let me try and move my camera thing over to the side here so I don't miss y'all's chats anymore. So just bear with me while I do a little camera adjustment here, guys. There we go. Oh, right on, right on. Yes, that Glaceon is gorgeous. Oh. So let's get this, get her in the sleeve here. Right. Oh, beautiful. Beautiful Glaceon. And the beautiful Ultra Prism sleeves. So, set that to the side for our pools. Let's get the bulk out the way. All right. Leafeon, what you got for me, buddy? So, starting off, second pack. Already got a GX. Cannot complain about that. And by the way, guys. So this will be on DVR in case you miss it, but uh, have a code. Anybody want a code? Have a code? All right. There's your chance. Three, two, one. It's done. Thank God these are on DVR, right? If you did miss it, you can go back and get it. Oh, you just did on our Guardians Rising ETB. That didn't get nothing, huh? Dang, I hate that for you, bro. I hate getting a box that has nothing in it. It's happened. Oh, it's happened. Okay. So, let's see. Let me do Patrick here. There we go. All right. So, we've got a Magnemite. Carnivine. Shinx. Possimian. Hip Hippopotus. Hippopotanomus. <laughs> Fairy Energy, Rotom, Spiritum, Ancient Crystal, Cosmoum is the reverse, and the rare is Empoleon. All right, so nothing shiny in that pack. All good, all good. Next pack, please. Next pack, please. All right. Move that out the way, and here we go. One, two, three, and four. One and two. I feel like I'm doing an exercise routine there. One, two, three, and four, and one and two and three. Okay, we've got a baby Trump, a Stunky, Scroopy, Piplup, Dub Hider, Metal Energy. Yeah. Oh, yeah, Shining Legends is beautiful. I've opened some Shining Legends on the channel, David, if you want to go check them out. Rotom. I just dropped my bolt. Mount Cornet. Hunchcrow. Can't wait 
for Gen 4 in Pokemon Go because I'm so tired of Murkrow's and I'm just ready to use that candy for freaking something. All right. Ooh! We got a Super Boost Energy Prism card. Oh, nice. Very nice. Good card. Good card. Next one is a Luxray Hollow. Nice. That was a good, good pack. But yeah, David, uh, I don't know if you can see. I've got... These are out of Shining Legends. I got these two Pokemon breeders out of the same ETB. That was an insane box. That was an insane box. Alright, guys. One second while I kind of pick up a little bit of the bulk I just dropped. Because uh, Pokemon, you know, cards are money, man. Don't want to just throw them on the floor and waste it. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. We can't waste money. Cannot waste no money. All right, back to the openings here. Oh, wait, no. Got to sleeve. Got to sleeve. Got to sleeve that Super Boost Prism. Ooh, that's a good question. Uh, no, I'm not selling these. These are for personal collection. But, you know, money was spent on them, so I don't want to uh, waste that money by damaging the cards. Um, and what I recommend... The Shining Legends ETB or a couple of GX boxes. I would actually probably recommend the Shining Legends ETB just because it is a uh, special set. It's not, you know not part of the main Sun Moon set. It's an offshoot like Generations was. So uh, I would probably recommend that because these uh, sets are going to be worth some money uh, in collectible value here in the future. All right, so moving on. We are now halfway through this ETB. All right. And, ooh, you know what? Have a code. Anybody want a code? Have another code. Why not? Three, two, one. Rip. Okay. And that's just to know that I've given that code away so I don't accidentally use it because I'm very disorganized sometimes. I'll put codes everywhere and I'll end up using one accidentally that I tried to give away on a video and that's not what I want so at least that lets me know hey that code's done don't use that Gibble Rilu Buizel Drifloon Yanma Water Energy Menfi Missing Clover Orangaroo uh, Hippodon is the reverse rare so that's a reverse rare the actual rare is a Magurnia. And yes, from time to time, I do play the online game. I have a good time with that. I haven't played in a while. Uh, and then I think I saw somebody else. Uh, someone said I should show off the full binder one day. I will do that. I don't have a lot because I really just started collecting. Uh, oh, don't open that off camera. Bad, bad, Cajun. Don't do that, Cajun. But uh, I just started collecting again when Sun Moon Base came out. So that's basically all I have is Sun, Moon, Base, and Onwards. A few uh, XY stuff, but not a lot. Uh, oh, wow. You couldn't get a Shining Legends ETB because it would only left you for t with $10 for Christmas. Yeah, I know. Those Shining Legends, it's an expensive set. Yanma. Shinx. Alolan Diglett. Alolan Volpix. Eevee. Fighting energy. Unit energy. Alolan the Trio. A skateboard. The rare, or reverse, is an Alolan Sandshrew. And the rare is an Obama Snow. Alright. So, so far, I have to say, just with the Prism and the 1GX, that's good. <laughs> Oh, she got you a Shining Legends Pikachu box. I saw those actually uh, at GameStop for like 15, 16 bucks. So, yeah. I was tempted to get one, but I ended up going with this instead. Gotta go with a new set, in my opinion, right now. Plus, uh, you know, I've already opened some uh, Shining Legends on the channel, and it's been a minute, about a month or so, since I've been able to do a card opening. So I figured, you know what? 
Go with the hive. Let's get the new set going. All right. Focus. Focus. We have a Dupider. Bronzor. Alolan Volbix. Alolan Sandshrew. Parchisiu. I think that's how you say that. I am not good with some of these mid-generation names. Like Gen 3 through 6. So I, I left out, really. So... Forgive me if I screw up a name. Dark Energy. Unit Energy. A Lowland Trio. Oh, shoot. A Skateboard. A Raquinid. And then the Rare. Garchomp. Oh, Pacharisu. Pacharisu. Okay, nice. Thank you, you bit too. Again, forgive me if I screw up a name. Admittedly, I don't think there's a single person on the planet that can name every single per you know, Pokemon perfectly. Hell, the anime can't even keep track of how it pronounces some names, so. Alright, Le'Veon. You gonna say you gonna give us? You gonna give us a great one? Give us a great pack. Give us one last great pack to close this ETB off. We got a white code, so it's possible. Ooh, we got a white code. Last pack of the ETB. Hey, that could be something. Could be something. Or it could just be a hollow. But we'll find out here in just a matter of moments. But we're going to start off with an Electabuzz. A Gibble. Roselia. Meow. Turtwig. Krogunk. Electric Energy, Hunch Crow, a Skateboard, Luxio, Sandalit is the reverse, and the final rare of this ETB is a Holographic Magmortor. Nice. It almost looks like a key. Might be the. I guess that's part of the card, but there's a line in the top here. Hopefully the camera will focus. Focus camera. Yeah, there's kind of a line coming out of the center thing. You might be able to pick it up. But it looks like, I don't know, like a printing gear almost. But then again, I guess that could be like the light reflecting reflecting off the, uh, the fire blast in there. I don't know. Be cool if that's a printing gear, though. I love printing errors like that. All right, guys. So that was not a bad ETB. I got to say, I'm very happy with that. We've got one GX, one Prism card, and then two Holographics. And then I do believe we also got that Reverse Holo Rare. So, yes, I am very happy with that. So let's do a recap, of course. If you're coming in or watching this on DVR and just wanting to see what the pools were, we got a Holographic Magmortor, a Holographic Luxray, a Super Boost Energy Prism card, and a Glaceon GX. So guys, I want to thank you all for tuning in to this live stream. Uh, thank you for dealing with the technical issues of me not having enough storage and just deciding to live stream this. I greatly appreciate that. And, uh, yeah, thanks, thank you all for joining in. We got three hanging out here at the end of the video. Two likes. You guys are awesome. And uh, I'm going to be trying to uh, get some PlayStation streaming here going soon. While I talk to y'all, though, because I want to ask you guys who are watching still a couple of questions. Uh, I guess I can thumb through and show y'all the binder here just as soon as I clean up my workstation. But I want to know... Would you be interested in watching some Grand Theft Auto 5 on PlayStation 4? And, uh, let's see. Content Wave was a success, you bit too cool. I'm glad. I'm very glad to hear that. You know, maybe one of these days I just need to come on camera and just sit down and just have a chat with you guys. Just a chat with Cajun. Yeah, I can call it that. Chat with Cajun. <laughs> But, uh, yeah, guys, uh, would y'all be interested in watching some Grand Theft Auto V live streams, some more Fortnite live streams? Uh, I'll be posting a, a poll on Twitter as well. 
So I want to try and see what games y'all like to watch me play the most on the PlayStation 4. Since I can't go out and about, it's still too cold and my baby is too young yet. So, she's a newborn. Can't have her out in the cold weather yet. Alright, got all the cards sorted. But yeah, I've got Grand Theft Auto V, I've got Need for Speed Rivals, I've got... Oh, you watched the Cops and Robbers one this morning? I gotta say, man, I was kind of impressed with my driving skills on that. But uh, my favorite part is just when I backed off the bridge, landed on the ass of the car, kind of spun around, and then took off. That was awesome. Alright, let's show off the collection here. I can fix my stuff. There we go. Okay. Nah. Alright, guys. So it just really starts off the uh, comment, you know, numbered through Sun Moon Base. Because, again, that's when I really started collecting again. But then we've got the reverse rares here. Trainers. Uh, then we go into. The one EX I have, which is a Charizard EX, that I actually pulled. Love it. You got Tapu Bulu, Lunala, another Lunala, Vikavolt. And let's see, some of the hol holographics. The Chestnut was actually pulled uh, from Steve Mann's Central. He sent me a pack of XY base set, and he sent me that. And so, got Incinemore, Swamp Rit, and then... These two I've got to send off to Trainer Jerry. He won. Oh, you love Fortnite too. That's awesome. This is my baby girl Lily's card. Pulled that out of Sun. Uh, Guardians Rising, I believe? And uh, yeah, since we also found out we were pregnant not too long ago, and it's a girl, that's going to be her card. So, so. And then like and Rock there. Shining Ho-Oh, Lola Ninetales, Enhanced Hammer Secret Rare. Two Pokemon breeders that I pulled out of the same pack or same ETB of Shining Legends. And then I believe, yeah, it's on that page. My secret rare Wishy Washy out of Guardians Rising and my secret rare Umbreon out of Sun Moon Base. Then I've got the Zerua line, uh, the Charizard, or Charmander line, Charizard line from Sun Moon. Then I've got a Raichu, two Entes down there. And then we got the Shining Legends Hollows. Uh, Tapu Koko Full Art. Then Turtonator Gyarados GX, I believe. Uh, completely forget where I got these. I am. I might be one of some I'm holding for a buddy. Oh, right on. And then these somebody sent me here. I believe they're, yeah, they're on the next page. The Japanese cards, but it's a Japanese Kangaskhan, Japanese Deoxys, and a Japanese uh, Bronze on Break. I believe uh, Julian, I think, sent me them. I'm not too sure. Then I got a Bozwell Full Art GX here, and then these two are Pallet Town Heroes. All the, these four here. These are his, card, his cards I'm holding until he gets him a better binder. But yeah, that's my collection. Ain't much, but it's mine. Yeah, guys, uh, thank you guys all for watching, if I can actually talk right. I appreciate y'all hanging out with me. I'm going to end it now because I got more stuff to do today. But uh, I love you all. Thank you very much, and I'll see y'all next time.